Every year, some Coloradans drive all the way to Wyoming where they can buy fireworks. They can't get here. Those fireworks are illegal here in Colorado. As Denver 7's Brandon Richard shows us, many are willing to take the risk. It's that time of year again when flocks of people from Colorado head north to Wyoming, where warehouses of fireworks await. Every plate you see is pretty much Colorado. I would say Pete Elliott manages Artillery World Fireworks just across the border. 65% You can often find him standing out front with his bullhorn greeting Coloradans. I see a lot of people. <laughs> I see a lot of people uh, ready, ready to break loose, man, celebrate their independence. In Colorado, fireworks that explode or leave the ground are illegal under state law. In some places like Denver, all fireworks are illegal. The rules are kind of rigged. You can't light up fireworks that go up in the air or stuff like that, which is, it kind of sucks. That's why everybody comes over here. Coloradans like Brian Martinez say they won't let the state's firework laws put a damper on their celebration. And what did you get? I got a black venom. Uh, associate inside told me that it sets off car alarms. So we want to put it to the test and see if it's true. Now, to be clear, Coloradans who cross into Wyoming here to buy fireworks and take those fireworks back to Colorado are technically breaking the law, but they don't have to worry about state patrol posting up at the border as soon as they cross back into Colorado. But they are taking some risks. Some counties have launched fireworks hotlines to report people popping illegal fireworks. Punishment includes fines up to $750 and possibly up to six months in jail. But it's a risk some Coloradans are willing to take. It's just about like having fun, lighting up the sky. In Wyoming, Brandon Richard, Denver 7.